No turnovers. On the boot. Samuel running to the back of the end zone. He was covered, though. Purdy chased from behind. Brock Purdy. Oh, boy. Brock Purdy. Found Ayuk. Not free. Uh, he did such a great job. We talked about this earlier. You've got to be careful when you do this style because when you reset and you go to throw it, you're going to get hit. Watch the big hit he takes, and Brandon Ayuk's going to be so disappointed that he didn't finish that. What a throw. Whew. That's who Brock Purdy is. Brock Purdy throughout his football life has been a risk taker. Purdy looking to throw. Given time. Coverage downfield tight. Keeps it alive. Lofts one up for Samuel. Downfield. Coming after him on third down. At the back door goes Purdy. He's got McCaffrey. Met right away by Holland. It's a sneak and it's going nowhere. Second effort gets it. Decisions for those head coaches and what ended a tie. Got rid of this one as he was hit and found Kittle. It's across the board. And it all falls on Brock Purdy, how he can distribute. Well, pressure from Max Crosby forcing Purdy to his right. And he finds an open tight end. Let's see if we get that chip again. Purdy spins out of the pocket. Throwing back of the end oh. zone. It's caught. And the toe tap by George Kittle gives the 49ers the lead. No way. Three 49ers in the area. There he goes with the lob. And that thing's sailing. But thriving. On second and goal here. He fakes. He looks. He's in trouble, but keeps it alive and finds Mitchell. Improvisation leads to a touchdown. Purdy, back to throw, pressure coming, steps away, looking to run, and he walks it in for the touchdown. Trust me, it's him behind that window pane. 14 0 Niners, Purdy makes a swim move and finds Debo Samuel. Are you kidding me? What a play, and the crowd loves it from Brock Purdy. Everything, and I'm telling you what, they are so solid. Now use checks line up in the slot. And now Purdy looks to use check over the middle across his. Late pressure coming, Purdy looking for Ayuk. Oh, what a dime by Brock Purdy as Brandon Ayuk snatches it into the red zone of Washington. The four-man rush, Purdy, nothing downfield. Smith Williams was chasing. Purdy gets out of there, looking deep back of the end zone. He's got Ayuk for the touchdown. For Brandon Ayuk as Purdy continues to find him. A 17-point Niners lead. Purdy is able to get through trouble and get to the edge. What a good run by Brock Purdy. Looked like a sack. And instead, not there, live to fight on the next one. Purdy trying to live for the next one from 10 yards behind a line of scrimmage. Lofts it. <laughs> Oh, there's Kittle to catch this time for the first down. That was the area you could get these guys. The tight end position. Purdy sliding, looking. Back across the body again. And who else? He came back from elbow surgery back in March. Here he's in trouble. He's being chased. He's going to get rid of it. He's got an open receiver. It's Ayuk. This to our third Super Bowl. On first down, Purdy trying to make magic happen. Oh. Finds Kittle. Raven showing blitz. Purdy is in trouble. Gets away from trouble and now flips it to McCaffrey behind his back and still a stop. Pick the McCaffrey on the boot. Kittle's in the end zone, but he's covered. Purdy keeps it alive and floats it in there. Touchdown. Throw it up for grabs and it's up. Just get him on the ground. Second down and short here. Purdy has one-on-one. -on -one. George Kittle. Touchdown! Gets you all caught up, and it's first down, and a blitz is coming. But Purdy, off his spot, still looking, looking to go deep. Has Brandon Ayu. He's got it down to the 30. Better. He just thinks there have been better opportunities led by Purdy. Curls out of trouble. Downfield. Wide open. McCaffrey gets up to run with it. For the touchdown. But watch how he exits out on this one because of the pressure up the middle. 
Gets turned loose right there is Roy Lopez. Feels it, exits left. McCaffrey escapes everyone and has the presence of mind. Purdy steps up, lets it go. First down to Brandon Ayu. Brock Purdy kept it alive. Empty it out for Purdy. Steelers bring an extra man. Purdy feels him coming, gets away from Fitzpatrick. And finds Debo Samuel. Great snag. First it made all the worst fears when you face the 49ers come true today for the Steelers. Purdy running and going down. 49ers and all their fans holding their breath right there. Our playbook at his disposal. Purdy in some trouble. Got room to run if he wants it. He's going to take it. Purdy inside the 10 and diving near the 6. Purdy has time. Can't find anyone. Stands in, floats with high, and it's caught. Oh, what a big play. And Juwan Jennings goes up to get it. From the 19, five to the pattern for Purdy, who escapes and fires end zone. Touchdown, Kittle. The very first game of his career. Blocking now from Brock Purdy. He throws in the middle. Perfect throw. Ayuk with a catch to the 43. Roll in that play. Here's Purdy on a fake. Now some pressure, gets away from Kaminsky, floats one deep down the field, and it's caught by Juszczyk, the fullback. Eight straight Pro Bowls for Juszczyk, and that's why is a huge chance come on down. Dirty, thinking about running for it, not going to get there, back across his body. Oh, one-handed catch, Juwan Jennings. Detroit secondary, by the way, here's Purdy. Looking around, pressure, steps up, going to run, has a little room, Purdy with a nice move, first down, Purdy's still going, staying on his feet, down to the five, and it's first and goal. Throwback of that. Here's Purdy on first down, late blitz coming, in trouble, Purdy stays up on his feet somehow, and now throws it and has a completion. How in the world did that work? Used to... Third down, four-man rush, Purdy in some trouble, escapes, looking for the first down, he's got it in more, Brock Purdy with the leg. 